Is that Eric Sloan loser gone? Beyond the News, with your anchor them, Eugene Victor. The War Party Congress passed a bill for the American people giving them each a $1,200 pittance in exchange for a vivisection of the Bill of Rights. Judas sold out Jesus for 30 pieces of silver. The old normal wasn't very good, but the new normal is anything but. None of this is normal. We in the news media lead by example, by following the Pentagon CIA. I've got my food allotment chip, my money allotment chip, and of course, my certified free of COVID-19 chip. The Democratic branch of the War Party, apparently feeling a little bit of buyer's remorse, has turned its five eyes to New York Governor Andrew Cuomo for salvation. Yes, the new criteria for the nomination will be the governor from the state with the most reported cases of COVID-19. So let's look at the top three. Andrew Cuomo with 60,000. Phil Murphy of New Jersey with 13,300, and Gavin Drinksome of California with 6,200. Page two. Friends, tired of people breaking the rules. It's good enough for the you, but it's not good enough for them. Then join the new Gestapo. We're looking for a few good, no, a lot of good snitches. The Gestapo. Papers, please. Now let's go back in time to our Beyond the News archives and our show from February 20th, 2018, at the height of that season's flu epidemic. Let's watch. Beyond the News, with your anchor them, Eugene Victor. Hey, man. The number of Americans with the flu jumped from last week's one million cases to this week's one and a half million cases. While the grim death toll was 4,000 dead Americans this past week alone. Well, we have a lot of National Basketball Association games to get to and also a bunch of gnarly concerts and a whole bunch of cool movies. Breaking news. A re-examination of John Lennon's autopsy report shows that he actually died as a result of COVID-19. Page three. Oh, we're going to go to Coco. And let's go to our correspondent, Coco Gijo, in Washington, D.C. Coco? Thank you, Eugene. As you can see, the streets of Washington, D.C. are eerily quiet. <gasps> As martial law slowly falls over the land. Coco, are you near Harborn Street? Harborn? <gasps> Did you say Harborn Blue Cheese? <gasps> I love cheese! <laughs> hey, buddy! Huh? Aren't you supposed to be quarantined? Well, still better treatment than that given to U.S. political prisoner, Julian Assange. Page three. Is he hot? Is she hot? Are they hot? But you're under government-ordered lockdown, and the last thing you need around the house is another mouth to feed. The dry new contraceptive delivery service. Yes, contraceptive delivery service is the safe, discreet way to go all the way. Delivery in 30 minutes or less, 60 minutes with our friends who are on Viagra. So call Contraceptive Delivery Service at 1-888-555-3825. That's 1-888-555-3825. Contraceptive Delivery Service. We come so you can too. Page 3, Dr. Fauci, everybody's favorite doctor these days of mass hypnosis. I mean panic, I mean pandemic. 
uh, co-wrote an article that appeared on March 26th in the New England Journal of Medicine. Quote, this suggests that the overall clinical consequence of COVID-19 may ultimately be more akin to those of severe seasonal influence. Who could have guessed? Time once again for Pesky Bill of Rights. Amendment 6. In all criminal prosecutions, the accused shall enjoy the right to a speedy and public trial. Good luck with that these days. By an impartial jury of the state and district wherein the crime shall have been committed, which district shall have been previously ascertained by law, and to be informed of the nature and cause of the accusation, to be confronted with the witnesses against him, to have compulsory process for obtaining witnesses in his favor, and to have assistant of counsel for his defense. Fuck off, jeez. Breaking news. Beyond the News has been outed as a Chinese propaganda outlet. Why, just look at all of the uh, Ranminbi I've received. Fuck. And that's the way it is. Monday, March 30th, 2020. America's endless war is now 6,748 days old. Martial law, 15 days old. This has been Beyond the News with your anchor them, Eugene Victor.